I, Victoria Diana, soon to be Suschek, after I undergo a long and tedious process to change my name to a name that will forever be mispronounced by everyone I ever meet, <laughs> will always love and cherish you. From the moment I met you, I knew you were the one. The way you stood in your finest mesh with those smoldering good looks. The way we locked eyes for the first time, I knew we were meant to be together as I was also in mesh shorts. <laughs> Even though it took you entirely way too long to share your feelings, luckily, with persistence, I was successful in being able to break down your walls to show you that you can be loved. I will forever be your companion, your rock, your Bella to Edward, and most importantly, your beautiful wife. I love you to the moon and back, and although you wrote these for me to say, I know this is all true, and that this is how you also feel about me. You are my power, my pleasure, my pain. <laughs> Baby, yes, that's right. I slipped seal into these vowels. For those that know my tall, dark, and handsome, newly acquired husband knew that something included seal was bound to happen. Love you forever. Victoria, I love you. Oh, that was pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> I am forever lucky to have met the girl of my dreams on the one day you decided to leave the house in my shorts. To today and to every day after, I vow to give you all of the love and kisses I give Sophie and maybe a few more. I promise to always rid the house of spiders, even though they scare the living daylights out of me. <laughs> I vow to love you when we're 85 and you're still listening to the Jonas Brothers because I will still be listening and very loudly singing Kiss from a Rose. <laughs> I promise to love you, respect you, support you, and above all else, make sure I'm not just grumpy because I ran out of Diet Pepsi. I vow to never stop telling you that you are beautiful without makeup on. I promise to remember that neither one of us is perfect, but will always be perfect for each other. You are my lobster, the person who brought me my widow baby, Sophie. I vow to love you, sass included forever. I'm humbled and honored to say, Nathan and Tori, you are now husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. Did what we could, my friend, but now we're at the end. 